I think you should come here if you want a really great experience. You have to pick a place where you're gonna be happy and I think it's easy to be happy in the environment here. The core of what, what we're about is building a team culture. Everyone here is very laid back, friendly and collegial. It's a great family type experience. I mean, we're here to take care not only of our patients, but also ourselves. We emphasize a, a culture of teamwork, collaboration, and wellness, and we value the experience and expertise that each individual brings to the program. And we're truly committed to helping our, our learners, our faculty, and our staff reach their full potential. I love the people that I work with. Once you come here and you're able to actually meet the people and interact with them, it's a very positive program. It's a really good program um, for people to kind of get to know themselves and get to know where they think they would fit at, not only in like what you want to study and what you want to do, but kind of lifestyle things. We try to keep a, a positive and, and light and fun atmosphere and, um, and a collaborative approach. And so we're, we're constantly looking for team successes. We have a large central hub where we have just this amazing collaboration of multiple subspecialty radiologists. Um, in that reading room, you'll see faculty that are sitting there with uh, residents, trainees side by side with our residents and our fellows. The ability to just walk across the hall or walk to the other side of the reading room and be able to work with people who are subspecialists in their fields and to give just that real quick curbside, hey, what do you think about this? Everybody here is really open to do that and they're actually really excited because the more you're exposed to, the better you become. We are a part of a multidisciplinary team here. We work really closely with the breast surgeons and radiation oncologists and medical oncologists and they're literally down the hallway from us. Almost all of our experiences are on one campus. Um, our children's hospital is right across the street. You don't even have to go outside to get to it. I think we've got a really great team of, of leaders, a great team of faculty, uh, teachers, uh, investigators, and, uh, and we're all committed to, uh, to training the next generation of radiologists. I think what you have to do is you have to have faculty that are invested in the mission high quality patient care and teaching and mentoring the you know the trainees and then also you know wanting to push the envelope uh, through research and clinical translation leaders across the board world uh, global recognized thought experts or thought leaders within the, the disease states that they treat all of them located within one practice here teaching residents is one of the best things that we can do um, obviously when you go into radiology and you make a choice to go into academic medicine, you are choosing to help the next generation of, of learners, of radiologists, become the, the, the kind of physicians that you, you, know, you yourself hope to become. Um, and so I think we take our educational program really seriously. We have a lot to offer here at the Medical College of Wisconsin, including four residencies in our department, um, Diagnostic Radiology, um, Integrated Interventional Radiology Residency, as well as the Independent Interventional Radiology Residency, and we also have a Medical Physics Residency. In addition to these um, residencies, as a Diagnostic Radiology resident, you have the opportunity to participate in the ESIR program. Um, if you so desired, um, which would prepare you to apply for an independent radiology residency after your diagnostic radiology residency. And we also have a nuclear medicine dual certification pathway, which would allow you to sit for the nuclear medicine certifying exam after your diagnostic radiology residency. We have fellowships in musculoskeletal imaging, uh, chest or cardiothoracic radiology, um, abdominal imaging, neuroradiology, pediatric radiology, and uh, breast or women's imaging, as well as the IR independent residency, which is kind of like the old interventional radiology fellowship. They're going to be treated with respect, uh, and they're going to be here to know that uh, we're here to help teach them, and you know, that's, and that we're, we're family and we're doing this together. So I think that's one of the, the one of, I would say one of the biggest takeaways. It's just the nicest place. In reality, I think the residents have fun here and the residents learn a lot here, and I, I get to watch them grow. I see, see you guys as first years when you come into, into my rotation and you haven't even seen a CT yet, and then I see you progress throughout your years, and 
it's amazing how much you guys grow and how much the residents learn and I think they're taught really well here. I think that what makes this a great place is the, the people that we work with, not only the radiologists but also the, the technologists in the radiology department, the nurses, our support staff, um, as well as the complexity and volume of cases that are available. All the good cases come here. We have a cancer center, we have children's hospital next door, we have a VA, we have transplant. All the things that you need to see that's going to provide you the information and uh, tools to become a great radiologist are here. A resident or a trainee or a fellow is going to have uh, an amazing experience because they're going to have this opportunity on a day-to-day -day basis to see things that perhaps they may not get at another institution um, because of our size, our physical geographic location of the population that we serve. It's not unusual for certain centers to really focus on one aspect of the training program that they do extremely well. And I think one of the strengths of our program is being able to harness the partnerships that we have. I think it's hugely important to be able to get that type of experience in pediatric radiology in particular because I think it's something that people don't see a lot of. You learn radiology from a variety of sources. Uh, you need to read, you need to go to lectures, but it's an apprenticeship. You have to read cases, you have to see patients in order to learn this job. Here you're going to see pretty much everything that you read about in a book because we see just about every pathology. If you don't see it live in person in the reading room, you're going to see it in a case conference. We, we got to interact with the clinicians here just, just, the right, just the right amount and really get to know them too. And it's, it's, it is a high-end, um, you know, a tertiary medical center kind of feel. The state-of-the-art equipment and technology that we use. So not only do we have, you know, the ability as physicians and individuals to care for patients clinically, but we're able to harness that with some of the best state-of-the-art equipment uh, with regards to imaging and image guidance uh, that's available. Uh, in many ways, we're a test site for uh, certain imaging um, uh, devices to help guide us and for treatments as well. And with the the vast practice that we have, we're actually access to a number of clinical trials where we can be uh, early adopters for new devices and new therapies for our patients that wouldn't otherwise be available. To be able to do the latest and greatest, to be able to do dual energy CT, to have multiple 3T MRI machines, to have research individuals that do research on MRI. So if you're interested in research, we have the people to get you in touch with that can help you develop that part of your career and your training. We're continually looking to expand our team with uh, individuals who fit our culture, who are committed to high quality patient care, and who are looking to grow both professionally and personally. It's a great learning environment and I look forward to coming to work every day. I, I love seeing the growth of the residents and they put in their, their time and their energy for four years in our diagnostic residency or integrated IR residency. Um, and then they come out, these excellent radiologists, ready to go out and, and take care of patients in the, in the world. It, it really feels like a success not only for them, but also for us as their, their mentors and their teachers.